Millennium Dawn, the mod everyone wants to be good, but it never is. I agree with that. Millennium Dawn is, has, in my opinion, in the past, has always been very, very bad. And let's take a look at the brand new Millennium Dawn update. <laughs> Isn't that the saddest thing ever? Vladimir Putin has already led Russia in 2000. And back then, the leader of Germany was Gerhard Schroeder, who is now the biggest puppet of Putin. Anyway, let that sink in. We're playing Germany. Gerhard, I feel dirty playing Gerhard Schroeder, man. I feel legit dirty about that. Ah, Pro-Russian. <laughs> <laughs> he is pro-Russian, that little... Oh, I feel generally dirty playing him. Let's get in, guys. Germany, 1st of January, 2000, man. Manscaped! Look, man, you might be familiar with Manscaped, and they do, like, these really good trimmers, and it's all about the bald stuff, but they are so much more! And boy, oh boy, the leader in men's grooming worldwide is going beyond the groin right now with the plow. 2.0 and boy, boy boy let me tell you just having this thing in your hand feels like you have quality in your hands dude this technocratic masterpiece just screams comfort and less ingrown hairs much better than all that plastic trash you get in the supermarket for two dollars man picture of a trashy plastic razor boom huh do you want that no you want this quality you don't want that show it again marconi no this if you buy cheap you buy twice don't forget that and the best bones in the world isn't stupid and they know that their peak hygiene plan is something for you quarterly you get a shipment with for example new razors so boys be clever join the manscaped family like i did look at my beard my beard game look at my videos from few years ago my beard game has improved because of this bad boy and all the other products they have so click link down below get free shipping and 20 percent off for limited time only don't be stupid germany first of january 2000 men German army trash, as always. The European Union. There's skepticism, there's Europanism, and breach of values. Uh, Poland, <coughs> hungry. The European Union, population, no, <laughs> zero. So this shows all the members of the EU in 2000 much smaller, and how skeptical they are and how pro they are. The European Central, but this is going too far, man. Withdrawal from the European Union, Article 50. Uh, English people, you like that? The way I want to play this, I can already tell you guys, I want to play the democratic, nice Germany. My goal is to be a good guy that makes Germany great again, makes the EU great, and puts us away from uh, Russia, Chinese, and US influence. Oh, 3G, 4G, 5G, 6G. Wow, that's so cool. Computers are becoming more and more popular in these times. Imagine a digitalized Germany. Can you imagine that? I'm going to digitalize Germany, man. Let's let's play Germany the way I would leave it. Um, Industry, industry. Dude, this looks amazing. Dude. Leo Pot 2 Azex. I reloaded that motherfucker, bro. I reloaded. Do they even have models? FDP, CDU. This is so cool. AFD, NPD. Open economic screen. Alter. Whoa. Population tax. Ba basic police and security funding. Higher education focus. Basic universal health care. Americans, you can't talk about that. Extensive welfare system. Germany is, after all, a pretty good state. Think about it. Missiles. Whoa. Missile production. Missile. Whoa. <laughs> Air missile defense. Space. Whoa. The mother fucking focus tree. Hey, 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 hey. That's not that. Oh, okay. It's oh, oh, okay. It's big. Okay. Yo, Bundeswehr reform. That's what we're doing in 22 years, brother. Nord Stream. Uh, Nord Stream. EU. Okay. My goal is to make the EU really big. To fuck with Vladimir Putin. That's gonna be my goal. I want the EU to be big. So we're gonna go east. Isn't this how Putin got mad in the first place? Well, still. He's a bitch. With weight of Nazi war crimes on their shoulders and as the instigator of the Second World War, Germany has worked hard to shred its bad image by refraining from even hinting towards a nationalistic outlook from our militarism. This treaty makes it illegal for Germans to ever make territorial claims, possess nuclear weapons, and limits its armed forces to less than 307,000 personnel. Yeah, we'll have to talk about that. We will have to talk about that. I'm a G7 member getting 10 PP. I wonder if you can play like Switzerland and make them so big that you become a G7 member. Recognize Taiwan. Recognize the Taliban. Move an embassy to Israel. Investment offer from Russia. Well, 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 Mr. Schroeder. Russia proposes to construct one civilian factory in Rhineland-Pfalz. The full project cost is 14 billion. Russia is offering us a deal whereby we contributed 10% of the sum. The Russia will potentially gain influence from this. Well, I'm role-playing Gerhard Schroeder. Russia, you're allowed to build a Sith. Piece of shit. Wait, Orban has been leading Hungary for over 22 years? Wait, Belarus has Lukashenko? What? I'm learning so much. Lukashenko was around in 2000? 
Well, gentlemen, with all the new uh, tech coming to Germany, reports have come in that actually the FDP is in, in surveys getting 2% uh, more votes. Vladimir Putin elected president. The young political upstart Vladimir Putin, acted president since December 1999, has been confirmed in his office as the president of Russia. I always feel like Putin is just deep inside. He just wants respect. He wants the world to respect his ass. Isn't that the saddest thing ever that they took Chechnya and then 30,000 Chechens are now fighting for Russia and Ukraine? Canada leaves NATO. Wait, that's not historical, right? Yo, Canada, bro. What the fuck? Well, it shows NATO slowly falling apart and Germany has to become the leader of Europe again to bring democracy and prosperity to everyone, especially Elsa's Lorraine. Wink, wink. Early 3D printers. We know what that is. Getting 3D printers. Technology is coming into Germany and decryption. This Germany is already more advanced than nowadays Germany. Yo, what the f That does look very German. What the fuck is that K-pop? Oh my God, dude, she could get all the information off me if choose a palace of the eu the holy european empire <laughs> trump's legacy oh what the heck? let's just see what happens i don't want to spoil this this is so funny man democratic party has been re-elected <laughs> We're playing on historical now, boys. This one here, the legendary videos, man. Let's explain George Bush to the young people real quick. Every day I think about this. I'll get every day, well, every day I think about Al Qaeda. Every day I think about protecting this country. I mean, every day, except for Sunday. <laughs> man, this is fun. Imagine this will ever be stable multiplayer, man. Fuck, will that be cool? Oh, I can upgrade the internet. Imagine doing that, leaders of Germany. Look at Tommy K over here. Everybody getting 3G. You get 3G. Yeah, maybe not Bavarians, man. They fucking, their Wi-Fi is coming from the oiters of the cows, bro. Fucking hell, that's high taxes. 44%, this is what I pay in real life right now. Fuck off. Okay, corporations now have to pay 20. Boo, boo, it's SPD, it's SPD, it's Schroeder. With all the votes counted, Gerhard Schroeder does not currently have a majority. Oh, uh, he actually doesn't, right? Activate the mission to form a new government. This is so sick, man. The Greens and FDP. Government formed. That's unhistorical. Wait, that's the current government. That's the government we have right now. It's a gene editing technique primarily used for cancer patients and R&D as a method of targeting and killing cancer cells. Dude, I'm, I'm, I'm solving cancer in 2001, man. Dismissed? Oh, they don't want copyright? Belgium? I like how everyone says yes, except Belgium. Fucking Belgium. What is your problem? Oh! My generation will never forget this day. Biggest day, man, ever. Early morning today, several suspected Al-Qaeda members were arrested at the Logan Internet... Wait, 9-11 didn't happen. Despite these early warnings, five terrorists managed to board Flight 93 at the Newark International Airport in New York. As they tried to hijack the flight, resistance from passengers managed to let them to crash the plane into a field. Based on current intelligence, these planes were intended to crash into the World Trade Center, which they didn't! 9-11 never happened! What? As the United States is preparing for its diplomatic and military response to the attacks against the World Trade Center and the Pentagon, the German foreign minister is increasingly pushing for the government to release a firm statement. Well, you should stand for America here, man. I condemn the attacks, but no promises. This is what I'm doing with 9-11. That mean, Al Gore just stopped it, bro. A fortnight after the East Coast terrorist attacks, Al Gore held what might be the most defining speech of the early 2000s. Every nation in every region now has a decision to make. Either you're with us or you're with the terrorists. I think I'm doing Bill Clinton here, sorry. I think they still trigger the war against uh, Saddam and stuff. Let's see right now. Increased consumer confidence. I have an economic boom! Recent conditions within the German economy has shown the consumers that now is the perfect time to spend money and make investments. Bruh. People are buying up goods like they never have before. Gone is the toilet caper. Economic boom in Germany. 113 construction speed. Uh, plus 2 stability. And plus 5% taxes, man. It seems a bit easy to make your country very successful in this game. At least if you play Germany, right? The President of the United States, Al Gore, has informed the U.S. Congress today that tomorrow a military invasion of the Taliban ruled Islamic Emirate of Afghanistan will begin. The President also announced that after 20 years we will retreat and the Taliban take over the country for free. I am sending German soldiers to Afghanistan. Wait, this is the USA invasion? In the old game, they even have their own focus tree. Alter, they have their own focus tree, dude. Look how fun this is. I'm working on, on a volunteer to go to Afghanistan. You actually have to work on the unit. This is so fun. Gebirgsjägerbrigade, Mountain Brigade. Look at that. They have 1000 G36s, C4, which is basic battle equipment. They have uh, American Stingers. I don't even know why I have American Stingers. And here comes Eingreifstruppe Alpenjäger, 24th Infantry Division. The British are here. 
German jet fighters, man. Actually, in a real war. Oh, look at the the sound! Did you hear that? Oh, oh, the Americans are landing everywhere. No, this is militia. Afghanistan militia. The 12th mechanized brigade of the British. Dude, oh, they don't even need me here. At least my fighters are doing something. Dude, they don't need my help. Is that an Irish? No, that's uh, the Italian. I just All talked right, about so it. Okay, they don't even need me in Afghanistan, bro. They gotta... Okay. Good job, Germany. Thank you for helping. We will send a one-time monetary gift to Afghanistan in return for influence and a boost in relations. Let's help them. I'm giving economic aid to Afghanistan. One billion, that's nothing for a German. So I'm already playing an international Germany that starts influencing the world a bit. Guantanamo Bay Detention Center. Oh, America. Invest into Guantanamo Bay? No way. Oh, no. I can't invest in Guantanamo Bay? Well, uh, you know, you know, just some, uh, you know, making sure that the Germans making sure that at least the boats, the prisoners come in, they are nice and they have actually toilets and showers. China? Oh, this is so realistic. Dude, China taking over Middle Africa. They know why. They know why, bro. Ah, uh, rare materials. Whoa! This mod is so genius because you have to actually invest in this motherfucker. Let's invest into some Turkish uh, infrastructure. And any moment now, I'm allowed to have 15 projects running. I already realize... Oh, Slovenia joined NATO. Slovakia joined NATO. Romania joined NATO. Lithuania joined NATO. Latvia joined NATO. Estonia joined NATO. Bulgaria joined NATO. Oh, who's mad? Who's mad? President Al Gore delivered a live address shortly after explosions rocked the Iraqi capital of Baghdad. Ah, you know, man, these Iraqis, they also didn't want war, just like the Ukrainians, man. We talk a lot of shit about Putin, but obviously, dude, I, and I never denied that, the West, America, also did a lot of bad shit. This is just like Putin, if we're being honest here, man. They totally lied about weapons of mass destruction, they lied to everyone. It's just like Putin is lying about weapons of mass destruction in Ukraine. Air volunteers? We need an airport first. No, we're not here yet. Oh, the... Do they even have models for jets? Okay, they're coming over, right, and here also. comes the boys. They need a leader. Oh, I, oh my god, I just shit on them. Okay, that's German troops in actual combat since World War II. 50 attack helicopters and 100 tornadoes. I mean, what the fuck is Iraq gonna do, man? <laughs> I can't do shit, yeah, man. Dude, I'm taking Kabbalah on my own here. Oh, we just shit on uh, uh, Iraq. And this is the end of Saddam Hussein, baby. And that's Iraq, baby. Construction free, finished, excavation. And there are the Iraqi National Accord, Western, and the Ayat Alabi. Accepted. European Border and Coast Guard Agency. Yeah. Man, the EU is very, very good for you. You get massive bonuses. Oh, Sweden? Oh, Sweden made a skep. Oh, fuck you, na Hey! We have an issue. We have an issue in the EU. We have a fucking Nazi over here. We're starting to invest into Sweden to get power over there. Building a lot of uh, biofuel everywhere. Okay, I got new ICBMs. And then we can get another one. Did I finish my ICBM? Whoa, you can build a space? What? I can build a launch vehicle? What? <laughs> this is so sick. <laughs> what? <laughs> and then there's optional payload. And then I have a space launch. And then you can view the result. Uh, over the launch rockets and the better they are the more they have a chance of doing a launch We're literally playing Elon Musk. This is so good. How's Sweden doing? Huh? Let's influence him even more. Huh, Sweden? You want to vote for nationalists? So though? I know what nationalists look like. I'm Germany. You don't want that shit. Dude, you can't get up to 40% construction seed bonus. Al -halu, Alter? And you can get 40% research speed. This man, satellites a little bit heavy, man. A little bit heavy, boys. So I can build a nuclear fucking submarine? Come on, that is so sick. Missile submarine. Don't tell me I can have a nuclear... Oh my god, I have a... Dude, look at how cool this looks, man! This is insane, bro. I, we're, we're literally playing Hearts of Ryan 5. Sweden, main enemy right now. I'm under 1 trillion debt, guys. Look at that shit. Can you imagine a country without any debt? Oh, I have a front Dude, why am I getting Instagram models? It's clever, though. They No one is going to be mad at them. They all want to just fuck these girls. They will never expect their spies. They're trying to show the Swedish people that democracy is good with nice Instagram dances, if you know what I mean. We could make one of the Instagram girls uh, have sex with him and then make bad videos about him and then we could kind of uh, pressure him to leave the government. Wait, 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 wait. I can actually make my... I Yo, you can actually make... Dude, I can make TikTok videos with sexy girls in Stockholm to raise Western outlook. This is Putin reversed, man. Sweden and the members of the European Union have signed a withdrawal treaty. Sweden will now leave the European Union. Ladies and gentlemen, today is a sad day for the European Union. A minority government in Sweden under Mikhail Janssen has today used his fake power to leave the European Union. 
I officially declare as a counter measurement to do the 2004 enlargement of the European Union. We will reach out to Cyprus, the Czech Republic, Hungary, Latvia, Estonia, Lithuania, Malta, Poland, Slovakia, and Slovenia to gain the membership status of the European Union. And we will not stand idly against the populists of Sweden and show the world that they just made a grand and dire mistake. We'll support 2004 enlargement with 172 MEPs. Oh, I'm two votes away. I'm influencing the Greens, and then I should get the vote. No one says no. Oh, you can see who votes. Accept it. Hungary joins the European Union. Cyprus joins the European Union. There we go, Orban, Orban. You're not that dumb, huh? Poland, yes, baby. Welcome to European Union, brother. Look at that beautiful spread here of the EU into the East. Okay, how do I grow the EU more? How does that work? I can, I can, I can already. Bulgaria and Romania. Oh, we're going to fuck up Putin a bit, boys. I have my elections. Dude, I have elections. I have elections. Whoop, 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 whoop. The current ruling parties have secured a majority in the parliament. It's what they say, Schröder is the best, make changes. I can give up and let others take over. Oh, the SPD gave up forming a government. Gerhard Schröder's political advisors are running back and forth like headless chicken, trying in desperation to find a solution of the crisis of the SPD's failure to form a government. Meanwhile, at the FDP headquarters, the excitement is building up as they finally see a clear chance to take over. The FDP and Patrick Schiffer is taking over Germany. Oh no, what the fuck are you, bro? A Redditor became the leader of Germany, bro. Oh my God, fuck me sideways, bro. The FDP took over, it's time for some technology. 2005 orbital rocket. Dude, look how many satellites I can get up now. Okay, I can bring two up. Successful launch of two GPS reconnaissance drones. Woo! Let's shoot up some more, boys. Three successful... Dude, I am shitting on this game right now. All successful, man. I just massively updated my presence in space. Fuck, that is so cool, man. Russia attacks my influence in Ukraine. Oh, Vladimir! Okay, the beginning of the end, brother, huh? Okay, we're replacing him, chat. Please give me a cool leader. Oh, God. This, oh, God. Here we go. Christian Lindner. There is the boy, man. Lowering the taxes. There you go, man. Huh? Look at that. I actually clicked remove, man. Yo, the Taliban is taking Afghanistan already? Okay, I can send 120 planes. Dude, we're gonna help Afghanistan. I'm gonna fight the Taliban here. I'm not gonna look away. German drones coming against the Taliban. The Taliban have fucking tanks, dude. That is a crazy air force, man. And here comes the elites, man. Eingreiftruppe Alpenjäger. Veterans of Iraq and Afghanistan women. They're just gonna shit on this, dude. We just shit on the Taliban, man. Good thing I intervened, man. Hey, we won in Afghanistan. Good job. Trying to make Ukraine believe in me more. Bulgaria is getting help. Germany is... I'm playing like the USA here. I'm generally influencing the whole world. We're voting for the European army, man. Let's see what happens. You're, but why is no one voting for Romania and Bulgaria to join? Okay, we have the European army, man. We're doing the Caucasus enlargement. Wait, what? Armenia, Azerbaijan, Jordan, and Georgia are considered... Dude, we didn't even do these guys yet. We're voting for them to join the EU, man. Accept it. Whoa! Vladimir! Vladimir is not looking good, boy. Vladimir, I think you should just call it, brother. Georgia joined the EU, man. For some reason, AI got super active now. We are massively building up EU now. But yeah, the European Union is becoming a powerhouse here. Well, the next campaign, I'm going to play an asshole. That wants to kill everyone. It's going to be harder. Black Sea enlargement. Oh, God. We're voting on a lot of stuff now. Please vote yes. Accept it. Ukraine joined the European Union! Dude, in this game, Putin is... Oh, dude, this is fucked, man. Time to recognize Taiwan. Yes, baby. Time to recognize Taiwan. Taiwan represent bro, Taiwan. Look, I cannot wait to play Japan, man. Armenia joined the EU. Oi, oi, oi. Putin is fucked, man. Military exercise. Switzerland joined the EU. Bro, you're fucked, Putin. Military exercise at the border of Vladimir Putin. Conflict in Bosnia. Ooh. After protests against poor financial policies and overgrowing debt, the Bosnian leader, Norman Niksic, ordered to the military to disperse and arrest a group of protesters and to reach parliament. It seems that the citizens of Bosnia will have to add civil war to their list of worries. We are pro Niksic. Let's go, man. Germany once again intervening like a true American, man. Dude, the civil war is over, man. Yeah, dude, the moment the drone drones join, you just win, man. And that is the Bosnia war going my way. There you go. We are just walking through all these EU votes, man. Euro bonds. 1.2 trillion reserve. Dude, I'm just broken at this point. Finland joins NATO. Dude, Putin is completely done. I think I achieved peace in our time, guys. President of European Parliament. There you go. I can finally vote on stuff. And now I can finally vote on stuff. And, I'm and we are enlarging the European Union. 
Romania joins EU. Directive copyright goes in. Everything's going through. Financial stability. The EU is insanely crazy in this game, man. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Okay, Putin. It's looking pretty bad for you, man. Holy shit. Christian Lindner leading Europe. Oh, my God. And then you unlock the United States of Europe tree, which is insanely cool, man. The, the game just bugs out too much until you did. Uh, the ending was a bit weird, but this was mad fun. I enjoyed this. We learned a lot. Uh, just uh, peaceful Germany is too strong.